you, and I didn't get to ask you yesterday, was you had said in an interview that Ichabod is like one of the toughest roles that you've ever had. Why is that? Why is Ichabod the toughest role I've ever yeah. played? Uh, because there are layers to him. There are lots of layers, but the, the line between them is such a fine one. Mm -hmm. It would be um, very easy to, you know, go down the comedy route. It would be very easy to go down the very earnest route. And it's just finding a balance between them. Uh, particularly when each of the scripts, every scene, there's a moment where it turns on a sixpence. Right. And it's finding the, the shifts and the nuances within that. That's a challenge, and it's nice. Plus, you know, running around North Carolinian woods guys, at three in the morning. Quick. That's, that's, that's exciting. Oh my I just God. want jeans and a t-shirt and a chair. <laughs> well, well you, you learn to drive a car this season or just continue to give romance advice to Ron Star? <laughs> <laughs> uh, Ichabod does learn to drive. Uh, during that scene, actually, there's, there's a few bits that, because obviously Ichabod isn't going to be the best driver in the world, there were shots that we were doing with me and Nicole and me driving, and then they said, okay, now Tom, open it up, and we'll take Nicole out of the shot and put the stunt guy in. And one of the proudest moments for me is I made a stunt coordinator squeal. Ah, <laughs> I love it. <laughs> do, you, do you do any ad-libbing or you know, drop in any quips during... Uh, um, I try not to. I think that, you know, we've got lots of very good writers, and I like to respect the writers with what they give us, that's, that's what we work for. Uh, occasionally when we go into a new set, I like to try and find things that would interest Ichabod or confuse Ichabod. Um, off the top of my head, an example, last year, the Roanoke episode, there's a scene where Ichabod and Abby are talking in the, in the police precinct, and I saw that there was sellotape yeah. on the table. And I thought, what would someone from the 18th century think of sellotape? And just little moments like that we try to find. But no, I, for the lines, I I let the writers do. I respect the writers. Well, the props will do it for you, though. And the props, yeah. <laughs> Is it hard learning all of the um, different languages? Because you have to learn some of these. Talk you have a lot of dialogue with those ancient words. Yes. What is it? Yes. Yes. <laughs> How long does it take you to memorize something like that? It's tough because some of the languages we did a bit of, I did a bit of German last year mm -hmm. for the Hessians yeah. and there was a little bit of Latin, which I'm kind of fine with. It's when it's languages that are completely different. So uh, this year we've just done uh, Shawnee Native American, which is so different. Yeah. And uh, that was very, very difficult to learn. And Romani as well is difficult. Thank you guys so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.